All right. What's up, everyone? Welcome back to another video, another unmiked video. We're just gonna set the down bar. It's a bit colder today. My phone's probably gonna die pretty quickly, so let's uh, see how many tricks we can rattle off. I do want to work on my switch backside today, but depending on how well the rail slides, we'll see about that. Um, you know, if it's sticky, we're definitely gonna be doing switch back ones. If it's not sticky, be sweet to get the one or two uh, switch back two poles. So let's see where we're at. Usually my warm up tricks are 50 50s, but lately I've been liking the 5 0s to start it out. Just a little extra, but not overly complicated. I'm gonna do a nose press next. How lame was that one? It's only the second hit of the day. You can't be too judgmental of yourself. Um, but that being said, it's not bad to be critical on yourself. I did a crooked grind and I didn't like that. Let's keep it straight and keep the press high. I'll take it and just move on but I was like I almost slipped off my heel edge on like the last six inches of that rail I'll take it. today's about having fun not about getting annoyed I'll definitely have those days this season especially if somebody convinces me to uh, start the battle on the back three nose press no spin off last season oh boy I don't think I've ever been more frustrated over a trick. And there's a reason that's never been done. It's dang near impossible to back through into a nose press and stop the rotation. But maybe I could get it. For you, Poshy. up this trick a little bit. I kind of want to do like switch nose blunt uh, 270 out like the same direction. Could be, could be cool. If I get that then I'll move on or I don't know. I'm going to get a bunch of warm ups locked in. Make sure we're filming. It's my first back one onto a down bar for this winter. I think I'm just gonna go back one, switch back lip, try and get a clean one, and skip those back blunts that I was trying. If you can even hear me. I don't know. Not really. Didn't even lock on to that one, but the next attempt will be locked on as if we got magnets attached just because I want to. Maybe we'll do a back lip or a switch back lip or whatever. Maybe do a pretzel out, or I guess technically the same way. 
or hold it. I don't know. I'm not sure what looks better. It's pretty chilly today though. Feeling nice and like ugh, shivery. We're still filming. That's good. I told you, just kidding, I don't want to be like that. But yeah, let's move on to something different. Switchback one's on. I told you guys I'd be doing that, so I should do that. And uh, oh, to be honest, my switch backside is lacking so hard. Like on tubes, it feels fine, but there's a reason for that. It's a lot easier. So let's just uh, give a couple switchback 180s a go on the uh, the nar bar here. See how see what happens. Maybe a taco? Oh. <laughs> so for my first switchback one, Jamming my nose into the side of the rail on the takeoff, it's not ideal. The fact that I didn't die <laughs> is ideal. And uh, pop higher next time. Other than that like nose tap to like, just go full safety mode, it didn't feel too bad on the takeoff. And I might just skip out on doing that. <laughs> Uh, hitting the end of the flat down, that might have thrown me off a bit. Especially when you're learning a trick. Just focus on the one trick. Make sure you're still filming. I gotta be cautious about this. Yeah, you are still filming. differently with my switchback ones, but I'm doing something because that happened twice in a row. Uh, like I think I'm like going up and trying to like steeply spin the back one and uh, I think that's throwing me off. So let's try to keep it a bit more flat. I think that'll do the trick. Good little butt slide though. Do I have any rust? I don't know. Not my day for switch backside right now, but I don't want to be that guy. I always say that I don't want to be that guy. I'm gonna do it. It's only a switch back. Let's make sure we're still filming. We are. Switch back one. Turn back. Come on. What am I doing? That's where I, I, you just gotta scare yourself. Like I know I can do it. I just had those few attempts that were throwing my confidence off. And I just had to override that and just fight it. I know I'm capable of that trick, but I don't know what those first attempts were all about. So, yeah. 
I'm not counting that one, I came off early. So it would be sweet to get the switchback one to a backflip. So I'll try and get that one. Take a deep breath. We got this. I like really jumped high to try to get onto that. It made it sketchy. Honestly, this video is going to be about uh, my rep, getting my reps in on switch backside. Because as I'm doing this, I'm realizing I don't do it enough. So let's just make it, let's just keep doing them until it's super easy for me to get into that back one. I'm not concerned about making it to the end, I'm just concerned about getting on to it and making that feel comfortable and smooth and clean. Right now I feel a bit clunky and I feel like I'm either under hopping or over uh, hopping and like dropping on. So let's just kind of try to meet in the middle. It's almost like you're going for like a, a quick like front board swivel, but like as quickly as possible. Um, and then like once you kind of get used to that, you can just speed it up and speed it up and then you're just you're just doing back ones on, no swivel. So let's work on this and uh, I think we should be able to get it. This could probably work as a back 180 on tutorial, so maybe that's what the title of the video should be. Yeah. Okay. Oh, I just scared the poop out of myself there. So, the only thing I did that like really just threw me off is I tried to follow a different rut off of the lip. And uh, then like the second I popped, I just felt like I was too close to the rail. And uh, I probably was. So, I'm just gonna stick with that original rut I was taken from. Why did I do that? That was so scary. What, what is that called? A, a Bennett grind? Like a 180 switch Smith? Ooh, shivers from that. But I'm not gonna let that scare me. I think I'm putting myself into like a bad rut with this trick right now. Overtaking it. Um, to be fair, I didn't do a single tube hit today. So I didn't actually like warm up any switchback one. I just kind of started sending it on the down bar. Um, and it's preseason. I don't have uh, all my tricks back yet. Ah. But that being said, if I'm smith grinding that and uh, keeping it safe, I think, um, I think, I think I can do it correctly and do it better. Man. I hate that feeling. Okay. Seriously, it happens to all of us. I think you got it then stuff happens and then you're scared all of a sudden but sometimes you just push through it
It's like turning into a mental battle now. Like I'm not, I'm not so many attempts into it, but I'm just like mentally freaking out on the run. -ins. But I just fight through it and uh, keep it going. It doesn't feel great right now though. I want to keep it honest with you guys. I'm curious. I might be able to make two videos. Like, I think if I can just keep trying this back one until I can get like two decent ones, I might call it there because I think that's like enough warm ups and repetition to just, you know, get my feet under me for the switch backside today. And then other days when we have more features than just these three, I could actually do like full top to bottom laps and do switch back ones on like basically everything. And in my opinion, that's like the best way to learn is. When you have a full park and you can just do the trick you're trying to learn basically like on every single hit until you get to the bottom that's my favorite thing at the moment we just got these three rails so i don't really want to just spend my whole day hiking and doing a switchback one until i got them unlocked but if i could get a couple decent ones and just get out of this you know terrible takeoff rut that i'm in i think we can uh have a solid day maybe get some other tricks on video. So let's get to it. It's feeling better, but it's not feeling great. Deep breath. Just gotta believe in yourself. Just gotta believe. Okay. Right here, guys. I'm gonna stomp. Like, I'm like getting close and then put myself right back in that same rut. Uh. Yeah, it's like I'm <laughs> halfway through my takeoff, I just like second guess myself, stop spinning, put myself into an even scarier trick to be in that you should never be in, which is a Smith grind or a Zeech or whatever. Ah, it's frustrating. Switch back 180s, that's all it is. I've done it so many times, but for some reason this season, it's, uh, it's getting to me. disappointed but I, uh, all I can do is either keep trying till I get it or be a big baby and stop trying it and I know which answer I'd rather have. the end of this video is two switchback 180s onto this rail. I don't care if I'm spinning off, not spinning off, or doing the back lip. I just want two. That's it. Two. Two to be true.
Okay. If I could just make it to the end of this rail. Two times. Twice. embarrassing no it's not embarrassing but dude what's that one what the hell Like, all I need to do is like kind of catch the inside slightly and then I'll post onto the top of the rail, make it to the end. It's exactly what's supposed to happen, but what's actually happened happening is like I just keep second guessing what I know. And uh, like maybe today's not the day to be trying this, and maybe tomorrow I'll get it first try. But on days like this, like I'd rather be able to just push through and just get it and get it consistent and just repeat it. And I'm just a little frustrated, but I think uh, you know what'll make me happy is just landing it. Me like leaving this trick is just gonna leave me feeling disappointed at the end of the day. So. I know I gotta do it. So far, that was my best one of the day. I landed both feet at the same time and takeoff felt the best, the 180 felt smooth, my arms felt in control, I just didn't make it to the end. If I can just keep that up, we can do it. Yeah. I just believe in myself. Just believe in my capability. Put this down. Let's put two for two right here. So like the past two attempts, getting on the rail felt better. It's just a matter of getting to the end of the rail now. I know this isn't really like a how to do video or like I'm not giving as much pointers. I think this is more like me just a personal battle video at the moment. And I'll have to do some back ones another time for uh, proper uh, explanations. Because if, uh, if I'm looking like this and trying to teach back one, who am I to say anything, you know? But, um, you know, my regular back ones are on lock. 
So if I'm doing a back one video, that's the trick I'm doing. I'm not gonna be doing it switch. So let's just keep at it. We got this. There's one. Totally could have threed off of that too. I kind of wish I did. I had the, I had everything in my power to three off of that. I just kind of was like, play it safe, just back 180. Yeah, I'm like, do I have learned my back 180s and switch back 180s? It's almost like automatically a pullback the way I do them. And uh, not really as much to switch or like half cab or pull 180 out. Make sure I'm filming and we can't just walk away. We're filming, we're good, we're good. Um, so it's a pain in the ass to relearn tricks, especially on like a real down bar. Um, you know, I went up to my regular back one. I got a switch back one, back one, and a switch back one, back three. So for this video, I'm calling it. I might go inside, grab a coffee, edit it up post it start on another one we're on that grind to making uh, this channel monetized baby i'm on a massive grind to get as many videos out as i can as many tutorials out as i can learn as many tricks as i can and just have a good time uh today in this in this video i was so frustrated trying that back 180 it happens like those first 10 attempts or whatever it was I seriously thought I didn't have it. And then uh, just persevered, took a couple falls, took a few like back 180 to Smith grinds, hated every second of those. Um, it's, yeah, like sometimes you just feel like crap, but I'll say this, like sometimes like, you know, on those days where you give up, you're really making the next day even harder, so. That's, I'll, I'm just gonna leave it there. Thank you all for watching and hopefully I'll get another video out today. So, let's see it.